today we discuss about economic importance of algae now discuss about algae the branch of botany dealing with the study of algae is called as phycology or algology algae defined as simple plants with an autotrophic mode of nutrition it covers many different organisms capable of producing oxygen through photosynthesis means the process of harvesting light energy from the sun to generate carbohydrates algae are prokaryotic or eukaryotic chlorophyll bearing thalloid organisms the thallus is unicellular colonial motile or non motile filamentous branched or unbranched and multicellular most of the algae grow in an aquatic habitat the mode of nutrition is autotrophic in this algae reserve food material in the form of starch they reproduce by means of vegetative asexual and sexual methods now discuss about importance of algae from the ancient times algae are used as human foods algae are beneficial as well as harmful to us now let us discuss about beneficial aspects of algae first we discuss about algae as food algae have more than 110 species of these mostly chlorophyllaceae phyophyceae rhodophyceae etc which are used as food for example porphyra is a red algae which grows in shallow sea water it is rich in protein near about 30 35% and carbohydrates 40 45% it is a good source of vitamin b and c chondrus crispus algae having a gelatinous carbohydrate is used in puddings rhodomenia palmata algae having salty confection commonly known as dulse in scotland it is chewed as tobacco lemonia is considered a delicacy in the manipur region of india and is locally called as mingam laminaria saccharina is known as kombu it is rich in carbohydrates near about 57 percentage of carbohydrate some red algae such as gelidium and gracilaria are used in ice cream and jelly chlorella is useful in space flight and nuclear submarines as food and also in recycling and oxygen regenerative system nostoc commune algae 
or boiled and used as food in China and Java. Codium, Monostroma and Ulva or some other green algae used as food. Now let us discuss about which is used in industries. What are they? In detail discuss. The products having commercial and pharmaceutical importance has been derived from algae. Example agar, carrageenan, alginate and diatomite are some important commercial products from organ origin. Now discuss in about in detail agar agar the algal species gelladium, pteroclarida, gracilaria, acanthopeltis, etc. are used for preparation of agar. It is consisting of two polysaccharides agarose and agaropectin. Agar more used in food, pharmaceutical and cosmetic industry. Agar agar is used in the manufacture of processed cheese, puddings, creams and jellies. In pharmaceutical, agar agar is used as a laxative. It is an important constituent of cosmetics. It is used for almost a century as stiffening agent in culture media. Now let us discuss about another carrageenan. This carrageenan is obtained from the cell of Chondrus crispus that means Irish moss and Gagatina stellata. In alcohol and sugar industries, this carrageenan is used as a cleaning agent. It is extensively used in stabilization of emulsions in paints and cosmetics. It is also utilized in the textile, leather and brewing industries. Now another that is to be alginate. These are sorts of alginic acid which occur in the cell wall of the brown algae belong to the order laminarias. This alginate extracted from laminaria, ascophyllum, fucus, macro, cystis, eclonia, etc. It is used in preparation of soup, sauce, cream and printing ink. This alginate is used as emulsifier in ice cream, synthetic cream, polish, emulsion, paints and jelly agent in confectionery and dental impression powder. This alginic acid stops bleeding effectively. Now another diatomite. This diatomite is obtained from death of diatom cells. First, it is insoluble, chemically inert and shows exceptional physical properties that makes it suitable for use in many industries. In oil and chemical industries, it is used as filter. It is heat resistant, hence used as insulator in boilers and blast furnaces. This diatomite is used in the manufacture of car and silver polishing powder, water glass, toothpaste, paints and phonograph records. This diatomite also used as a filler for battery boxes and with 
decalage for switch and fuse boxes. Now another funery, a type of glue known as funery, which is obtained from glyphosate for cattle. It is used in cosmetic industry for hair curling and dyeing preparation. This funery is also used as an important in paper and textile sizing agent. Now discuss about in ag agriculture. Terrestrial algae play an important role in soil biology. Blue green algae act as nitrogen fixing agent in rice fields. Now, nitrogen fixes. Anabena, Tolipotrix, Orocera, Oscillatoria, Nostoc, and many other members of Sinophacy have the capability of fixing atmospheric nitrogen. Blue green algae and azolla constitute a system which is the main source of algal biofertilizers in South and Southeast Asia. Next, organic manure. Large brown and red algae are used as organic manure. They are usually rich in potassium but have relatively low nitrogen and phosphorus proportions. Next, soil fertility. Algae also affect soil fertility directly. The extracellular products serve as a source of carbon and nitrogen for microorganisms in the soil. These microorganisms in turn help in preserving the nitrogen, sulfur and phosphorus elements present in the soil. Now reclamation of saline and alkaline soils. Blue green algae or helps in reclamation of saline and alkaline soils. It decreases in pH and increases in phosphorus, nitrogen and organic matter containing of the field and thus converting it into fertile and cultivable land. The last, coralline and lime depositing fields. Some coralline and lime depositing algae such as lithothamnion and lithophyllum are used for liming crop fields. Now, in next class, we will discuss about harmful aspects of algae. Thank you.